Hi folks, it's me again. Uh, I wanted to do a video on Gold Leaf because a lot of customers call me and they don't know what Gold Leaf is. They think it's paint, they think it's um, maybe sprayed on or brushed on. And it is none of that. Uh, it's, it's actually uh, truly 23 karat gold and uh, it comes in these three and a half by three and a half inch sheets. And this is it, this is 23 karat gold. And uh, how you prepare the surface is, of course, you got to have a clean, dry, painted surface with no dust or debris or oil on it. And then you paint this stuff right here on it. Uh, this is gold leaf size, and this has to dry for between 12 and 24 hours. The longer you let it go, the better. Uh, you want it to be just, just sticky. And what I usually do is I do it um, maybe mid-afternoon or so, and then come back to it first thing in the morning to see what the tack is on it and usually what I do is I take the back of my finger first thing in the morning and I'll go like this I don't know if you guys could hear that squeak but that squeak tells you that the gold leaf size is just right then what you do is you take these leaves and you place them on there and they're sort of delicate very thin. This, this stuff is thinner than paper. And you just sort of guide it on with the brush a little bit and press it down. And it sticks only to where the size is. Nowhere else. If you're lucky. Sometimes if the paint's not quite dry enough before you put the size on, you might have a little problem. And these little shavings you can pick off Now some places like Proctor's, their entire interior on the ceiling there is, is decorated with gold leaf. Uh, but that's not actually the same stuff. That's a, a Dutch metal. It doesn't have to be 23 karat because it's not exposed to the elements. And this is something that's not done a lot in this country. Uh, we use it for signs and things, not as, as commonly as we used to you know, 20 some odd years ago when I first started. Uh, there's, there's other things that people use now. They use paint and, and the like, but it never really has the brilliance. When the sun hits this, it's so beautiful. If you ever look at the uh, domes on a city hall or a college or something, you'll notice that it, it glistens in the sun and it never tarnishes and uh, it is impervious to the elements. It, it might show a tiny bit of wear over years, but uh, not a whole lot. And that's just from the rain beating on it because gold is soft, but it never tarnishes. But uh, anyway, I'm not going to bore you with this. Uh, watching me put this on too much longer. I do have a completed one here. This one I did uh, first thing this morning, and as you can see, it's very shiny. <clears throat> and the final final step to this is to burnish it. And you burnish it just with some some plain cotton like this. And what that does is just that takes all your shavings off where the leaf overlaps. You don't really want to see that. And it just sort of shines it up a little bit. But anyway, that is what gold leaf is. And like I said, it's not paint. And it is genuine 23 karat. Um, if it is not exposed to any handling, it does not need to be cleared. 
and you're always better off not to clear it if possible because it just looks better without the clear. But anyway, that's it folks. Thanks for watching.